we're gonna try and catch some big old dragons on these top water bad boys. I'll take it. That is a tank. Oh, I'm on. Oh, shit. The microphone's over there. Oh. Come back close to me. <laughs> Today is day one of trying to catch a fish on a Donald Trump lure. He's right there. He's right there. Shut the fuck up. No, this freaking turtle. Oh no, did I just lose my lure? I got my. I got that long neck. Maddie to the rescue. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another episode of CEO Fishing. Today we've got the man, Maddie Two Gats. Maddie, introduce yourself. Tell them about your crew and the whole nine. What's up guys, Matty Two Gats with the Fish Frenzy crew. We're uh, based out of Palm Beach, Port St. Lucie. Uh, big multi-species anglers from oh, yeah. freshwater exotics all the way to saltwater grouper, snook, whatever you want, we get, you know what I mean? Boom. We're gonna test these things out topwater to try and catch some massive snakeheads. So guys, stay tuned. You don't wanna miss it. any seconds of this because we're gonna have fun. So much fun. We're gonna have fun. Let's go. In honor of the Donald Trump fishing lure, I've got Make Angling Great Again t-shirts 2024. So if you want, if you like the shirt, you want to go check them out, go to ceofishing.com or you can go to my Instagram store at Brian the CEO to buy some. And I got other gear on there as well if you want to check it out. Guys, let's go uh, catch the biggest fish, the best fish. You've never seen a fish this big before. That's a horrible impersonation, but we're gonna go get some fish right now stay tuned hit subscribe turn the notification bell on right now because you don't want to miss any upcoming episodes maddie and i are about to go get it CEO Fishing is brought to you by The Real Hooker Bait and Tackle, Nines Optics, and Livingston Lures. Come on, Don. Donnie boy. Come on, Donnie boy. Look at his lips, bro. Look at his face. <laughs> wow, they did pretty good. They did. Ready? Yeah. All right. Warm up to done. That was a big old dragon rolling on the top water, dude. So that's what we're looking for. We're looking for a big old bullseye snakehead. And the key really is to kind of creep up on them slow. And when you're casting across the bank, that's ideal because they're kind of over there untouched, unmessed with and not scared. You want to kind of retrieve at this speed right here, you know, and then you want to stay along the bank here because usually they congregate right off the bank. They wait for any bugs, frogs, anything to jump in the water and they just boom. All right, I am up. Donald Trump in the house. His ear looks okay. Looks okay now, but you can see, you can see where the, the bullet hit, like right there, right? So, Matt, you said the cast right at the culvert? Yeah. Something just rolled right there too. I'm gonna get. <sighs> hmm. We're just throwing this Donald Trump lure up and down these canal banks. We hit one spot, you know, wasn't too much there. We're in the second location and uh, we're just, we're gonna keep going until we get tight. You like that cast? Yeah, I liked it too. This is the part that I like right here. Okay, you see this tree? Big old tree right here, there's shade underneath. <laughs> and in Florida, let me tell you what, we need a lot of shade because it is brutally hot today. Something just rolled where I was casting earlier. 
I'll fish 10 different ways until one of them gets hit. And what I've noticed, the same. you know what I mean? And what yeah. I've noticed for me is when I like hit that bank and it jumps in the water, I just start pulling it. Cause for me, yeah, it's that. And then I'm also convinced the longer my lure sits, the more they can tell that it's not real. And I feel like if I don't give them the chance to see how, you know, fake this lure is, then they're just going to think it's food and they blindly hit it in aggression and, you know, reaction and boom, now we're hooked, you know? I still got him on. He's on, dude. Oh! Oh! oh. Is that a large mouth? Dude, that's a... Yeah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, that's a nice one, dude. That's a nice large mouth, bro. What? Holy That's my PB large mouth! No. That's my PB large mouth, too! Let me see. Let me see. <laughs> oh, I got a cramp. Dude. Oh. Holy That's a unit, dude. What? That's a unit. Dude. I'll That's take a, it. That is a tank, bro. I'll take it. That is a tank. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. You said there's something over there. Oh, dude. No. Bro, let's go, let's go. Now that large mouth, in the moment, I was excited, it was it was big, but it wasn't my PB. I thought it was when I first saw it, but my PB is actually six pounds, which is not great, but for me, it's amazing because I don't really see that many big large mouths where I fish. Have you, just, have you ever got stuck halfway in a sneeze? Yeah. It doesn't come out, yeah. but it's not going away? You gotta stare at the sun. Oh my eyes, look at them now. <laughs> <laughs> Cut! My last video was about some of the stuff that I saw at iCast, and one of the booths that I did run into at iCast was the line cutter booth. They also had the Donald Trump lure, the Joe Biden lure, and in one of the next videos, I also have a Zelensky lure, or as Biden would like to call him, Putin. I'm on again. Peacock! <laughs> you... Someone just said I could catch a peacock bass, and that's not a shabby one right there, buddy. That's not a shabby peacock bass right there, buddy. Hey, I need my landing assistant. <laughs> oh, stay on, baby, stay on. Stay on, you know what? I. Oh, yeah, you yeah, yeah. Woo! Oh, my gosh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. I am having the time of my life, my guy. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is going on here? You just told me. You literally just told me. Let me open my bail real quick. That is a healthy peacock bass. Dude, that is a unit. Yeah. All right, Maddie. If you want any tips, Maddie, you know, just let me know. I'll, I'll, I'll help you out. Wow. Another one. <laughs> Maddie on. Maddie's on. What you got? Nice peacock. I was totally expecting. Yeah. Hell yeah. Dude, I was totally expecting a freaking largemouth. Oh my god. I don't know, just Chill, bro. Ooh, nice. That thing blew it. That blew up. Oh. And I almost got a bird's nest. We threw all types of top water. It wasn't just a Trump lure. Uh, Maddie threw probably three or four different frogs, all top water, and we didn't get one hit. So I had a swim bait on me and decided to kind of throw it down low and bounce it on the bottom to see if something would bite. And that's when everything turned on. <sighs> this is a uh, fitness fishing, guys. Fitness fishing. How many pounds you lost today? At least 10. At least 10 pounds. Least. That's 10 pounds of fish. <laughs> it is hot. It is humid. It is muggy out here. Too but you, humid. But you know what? We're about to hit another spot. And uh, hey, just keep watching because you know you never know. We might catch something. We're gonna catch something. Y'all didn't see that cast. Well, while you're messing around in there, I'm gonna drop that right there. Oh, I see the pipe.
Oh, I'm on. You're on. Oh, shit. Got one. Nice. Dude. Nice. Dude, that's a big one. Nice and easy. Oh, oh, he's barely hooked. Oh, come on. Try and get him a little closer. That's my PB snakehead. Is it? The hell yeah, that's my PB. Oh, yeah. Very nice. First one of the day. The microphone's over there. All right, guys, so this is my PB snakehead. I just kind of whipped it up underneath this shadow line over there. Uh, nothing was hitting top water, so I threw something to drop it down, and he just thumped it, man. Matty, elbow bump. Dude. Appreciate it, man. Let's go. PB's all day, baby. Well, there you go, guys. There's no yes or no Donald Trump is the best or worst. It's only the top water bite was not good, and I just got to go try again because I need a spot where the top water bite is gonna be fire to be able to use this lure because it's a top water lure. The people who fish know the deal. If the top water bite is not on, the top water bite's just not on. It was extremely hot outside and that's why everything was down low. So if you still wanna see Maddie and I catch fish on the Donald Trump lures, make sure you're subscribed to the channel because I'm gonna link up with him this week to go out again to see if we can get that top water bite. You know the conditions have to be right. The location has to be right, and the flick of the wrist has to be perfect. Guys, make sure you go subscribe to Maddie's channel. I'll put the link in the description below, and also follow him on all his social media platforms. Maddie stuck to his guns. He was throwing that top water after top water after top water with no results. And we had just discussed earlier in the day, like sometimes you know you need to switch up your lure, but you also know that that particular lure or type of lure gets smashed in an area that you're at so you kind of just stick with it despite not getting the bites well that's what he did you know but at least he finally got the peacock bass so he wasn't skunk so welcome to team no skunk maddie and uh, appreciate you putting me on my pb snakehead that's the show guys make sure you hit subscribe and turn your notification bell on right now especially if you want to see us continue using the donald trump lure because we're on a mission to catch a fish on the donald trump lure so you don't want to miss any of it again subscribe notification bell give the video a thumbs up leave a comment all that cool stuff but until next time guys keep your head up keep moving forward in tight lines Zzz.